offense. I know that it won't do anything to us. Uh, we'll be able to bounce back from that and correct the things that we need to correct. Uh, Texas a and is a good team, and they have a lot of good players over there. So uh, we can't we can't be down on ourselves. You know, that would be the wrong thing to do. We're just going to shake this game off and be ready for next week. As the sacks go, the pressure that you had on me for passing, was there a point in the game where you kind of felt it come in, kind of expected? I mean, what was going on? I mean, really, I just, you know, sitting in the pocket, um, looking downfield, seeing if I have anything downfield. Um, fortunately, you know, sacks happen. Um, but, you know, like I said, we're just going to, you know, put this passes and look forward to next week. Yeah, I mean, this doesn't define our whole season. Uh, like I said, we're playing an SEC team. You know, that's a that's a high caliber, you know, game of football. You know, that's a, that's a good solid football team over there. Uh, so I'm not gonna put that past them. Like they're not good. Uh, you know, for us, we're just gonna you know put this past. Them, like I said, keep working on things that we need to get better at, um, and, and get ready to you know go play Utah. Is there a belief that you guys are much better than this, or is it just a matter of Texas A&M defense being challenging? No, nah, uh, I'd say I'd say we're better than that. You know, we put on the field for sure. Um, you know, I'm not going to say that we were going to go out there and put 40 on them because they definitely made some plays out there as well. Uh, but there's, like I said, there's things that we could have done better. Uh, but you know, can't do anything about it now. Game's over, so we have to move on.